to my YouTube channel. Hey guys, so today we are going to be talking about braces. I've been getting so many messages from my family and friends that have been watching my YouTube videos saying, Jasmine, when did you get braces? You got braces? Why did you get braces? It's braces, braces, braces. So, this chair is not comfortable. So I am going to discuss with you, my fellow audience, all about my braces and what you need to know, what you should know. It's gonna be all about braces today. I got these braces on October 6th. So we are just hitting the three month mark. I've had these bad boys on for three months. And I did vlog a little bit of the process of me getting my braces on. I will insert that now. Roll the clip. Sorry, I'm recording on my phone because that's all I have. Ladies and gentlemen, today is the day that I get braces put on. <sighs> my life is about to change forever for the next two years, but it's going to feel like forever. I need to just take in this moment of no pain, of like, just feel this, because it's about to change in the next three hours. These teeth removed. So this is what my mouth is saying right now. the before and then I'll be back with the after and I'll try and take you guys along as I'm getting them put on as much as I can it's gonna be kind of awkward because obviously I have no one to record for me um, but yeah welcome to my teeth vlog my braces journey I'm super excited though because I've always not always, but I've been insecure about my smile for a while now. So it's going to be crazy seeing the transformation. And I'm just really excited, actually, to see the transformation and the process over the next two years. Yeah, it's my side profile. For me, I cannot. Like, you see how my top teeth protrude it's the side profile for me it's so crazy because of course as soon as these heal the pockets and I can finally eat again I'm living my life I can chew again boom braces it's like oh okay back to soups and apple sauces I just wanted to do a before and I'll see you guys when I get them on. Okay guys, I'm on my way up to the orthodontist. I have arrived. I took two uh, extra strength Advil's before going in here to help with the pain. So I'll keep you guys updated. Your girl has braces. The sun is leaving. How are we liking the new hair? Who is she? New hair who dis? I chopped it all off. It's all gone. She's new. She's fresh. She's short. But we love. So yes, like I was saying, I really didn't like my side profile and my overbite. And there was also a lot of crowding going on in my mouth. So because of that, I first booked an appointment with an orthodontist for Invisalign. But then they said that I wasn't eligible for Invisalign because my teeth were too jacked up. So he mentioned that I'd have to get teeth removed and all this stuff. And I was like, whatever, go for it. 
four teeth removed and then I got my braces before my orthodontist appointment I made sure to get all my cavities filled as well as a teeth cleaning it's super important to get that done before you inquire about braces because you don't want to put braces on teeth that are dirty or that have cavities because it's just not gonna be good. Before I even went to the orthodontist, I made sure that that was all ready to go. Went to the orthodontist, they said that they had to pull out teeth. So I went back to the dentist, got those teeth pulled out. That was a hot mess in itself. Mm. I ended up having to go back a couple times after I got these four teeth pulled out because I had something called a dry socket in three of the four sockets. So that was not fun at all. That was very painful. So, and then, <clears throat> once those four sockets healed, it was time for braces. The first day felt super weird. I could not eat anything. I couldn't even do this. I could not do that. That, doing that hurt so much. Just because, like, I hope this lighting is okay. I'm looking and I'm like, Mark. Tanya! <laughs> I don't know what to do! It looks so dark! Can you show me the top of the camera? Yeah. Oh, this part? Yeah, push that button down. This is so much better. Thank you, Jesus, for Tanya Archer. Sorry about that, guys. The lighting was not cutting it, but this is so much better. I'm so happy. Like I was saying, what was I saying? I, I couldn't even do this for a while, for like the first three weeks after getting my braces put on. The pain was so, it wasn't even pain. It was just the sense, sense, the sensitivity of my teeth were just to the next level, above and beyond. My teeth were super sensitive. Um, um, so eating anything hard, if I can't even do this, chewing food, it's a no. It's gonna be a no. So stick to soft foods like soups, mashed potatoes were my best friend. Really just soups, pasta, mashed potatoes, anything the applesauce, yogurt for at least the first three weeks. Like it was intense. Um, but after a while, like it, you kind of get your teeth obviously get used to it and it's not as tight. And then you'll be eating food in no time again, like harder food. For the first, I would say, month and a half, one of my teeth at the top were super sensitive. Like even when I put my toothbrush over it, oh my gosh, it was just, it just felt like a nerve was being pushed um, on that one specific tooth. But now that's also fine. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much my braces journey. It's been three months. I have two years all in total so <laughs> that's fun as long as these babies come off before my wedding my future wedding with i don't know who but we're good as long as that happens i love the journey so far these bottom teeth are already changing drastically and it's just been three months so i love seeing like the change and the transformation now i'm just gonna go into detail with you guys about what i use to clean my braces and to take care of my teeth to make sure that my gums are super healthy and then, yeah let's get right into it so we're starting with her i take this little pack with me everywhere i go it's always in my purse because i can't be having food stuck in my teeth I can't be having bad breath. No, no, no. So, let's dive right in. This is like essential, guys. You have to have a care kit with you when you have braces. Because you can't be walking around with food stuck in your teeth. It's not cute. ASMR. Okay, 
So first we got our handy dandy mouthwash. Super important for after you wash your teeth, I think. It's just really good to get rid of bad breath. Toothpaste. This one is a whitening toothpaste. That's always good, especially with braces. I feel like my teeth um, kind of can look a little yellow sometimes. Oh, thank you, Tanya, for helping me fix the lighting. So this is just floss that I use. But you can't be just flossing your teeth like with braces with just this. So you have to get this to go with it. It's like a loop. It's a loop and then this part. You put the floss through the loop and then this part goes through your tooth through your bracket and then you just floss. I'll show you guys one day but today is not the day. So yeah, got these from Amazon. I think I got everything in here from like Shoppers Drug Mart and Amazon to be honest. And then I have my little toothbrush. Super handy. You just go like right into the washing room after you're done eating or at your friend's house and just brush your teeth quickly. So cute and like mini size. These to just get in between your brackets. It's actually so crazy how food can get stuck in there. Um, so you really gotta use something like this to get in there, in between the brackets to get the food out. And get into the bottom. Some handy dandy wax. So, what you basically do is take a piece of the wax and you just kinda like rub it in between your fingers. Get it like to melt it a little with the heat of your fingers and you just place it on the bracket that's bugging you so then it won't keep irritating the area that's already like sore in your mouth I don't know what I would do without that because let me tell you the pain I've been in next the sun is leaving me there's a lot going on next oh next I have this Advil. Oh, well, it's not Advil. Aleve. Bootleg Advil. For headaches and for teeth pain, if I have any, after getting my braces tightened. So this is really good to have. This is my favorite item. Can you guess what it is? If you guessed Amira, you guessed right. That to you guys. Hey! I got this mirror off of Amazon. This mirror lights up, guys. Like, hello? Yes. You can get all of the nasty stuff that's in your teeth. You can see it and you can be like, oh, let me just pick that out. I love her. I love this mirror. Of course, pink. Of course. And next, this pouch within a pouch. And here we have more of these sticks to put in between your teeth to clean. Just take that off and that just gets right in there and in between the brackets. Like areas where your toothbrush can't. So I have a bunch of those in here. And then at the bottom we have mint because I can't really chew gum with braces mints are ideal to have for fresh breath so let me just pack that back in here this one goes first and that's everything super handy I love this um, little package that I have for my teeth and it's also so cute I use an electric toothbrush to brush my teeth and this just pops right off and you can put it into the traveling case that it comes in and the traveling case actually charges it also. After I brush, I go in with these guys, just get anything that the toothbrush might have missed and then after that's when I would go in with my flossing and then after flossing, if I'm feeling fancy sometimes, 
I will go in with her. Oh, water flosser. Last but not least, I go in with my mouthwash. I have to get non-alcoholic mouthwash because I found that it was burning a little too much. I'm like, this is uncomfortable. I can't even rinse my mouth like without it hurting. Why is the alcohol so strong in mouthwash? So I got alcohol free mouthwash so that I can swish around without being in pain and just like enjoy my nightcare routine. This is always my last step and I never rinse my mouth after um, just to really let the fluoride sit and to prevent those cavities. I'm definitely taking my teeth and my gum health seriously because ain't nobody trying to have dentures at the age of 45. Taking care of my teeth. I'm excited for the process of my teeth journey. I will show you um, when I first got my braces on to last month's progress to this month's progress. to see the gaps fill in that's gonna be great I hope this video helped you if you're thinking about getting braces I really hope um, that it helped and if you guys have any more questions about braces or the process please leave a comment in the comment section below and I'd be more than happy to answer any questions that you guys have about braces or my experience if you have tips and tricks for me I have a tightening coming up in a couple days. Please, if you guys have any um, tips or information about when you get your braces tightened, let me know. I would really appreciate it. If you guys have any suggestions of what colors I should do for my bands, let me know. Why not? That's this video coming to a wrap. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. You already know what to do if you did enjoy it. Don't gotta say it. But I will display it. So yes, guys, enjoy the rest of your day or your night or your afternoon. Whatever. Bye, guys.